so fucked up, I see murders filling in the pot. Talk on the night, I make my folks go and flat as fuck. Real stuff, he got six toes, he a preacher. Watch it every day, he don't get no fuck, he tryna leave some. Niggas know what happened by 4 9 when you bleed. Fuck up in the hole, my bro, when niggas on the teeth. Killing all the What's up, y'all? It's your girl Diamond, and I'm back with another video. As you can see, make your bed up and get your bread up, period. And before we get this video started, I just want to say um, thank you, God, for another day. So, basically, this video is going to be about um, how I found out I was getting cheated on part two. And, yeah, um, y'all need to let me know what kind of videos y'all want to see so that I can drop more videos that y'all like or whatever. But I do got more videos coming, like I said once before. And... Yeah, I don't know where to start it, but I'm gonna make I'm gonna try to make this fast or whatever because this tattoo itching and I ain't putting nothing on it when I got out the shower, so I'm trying to hurry up. Okay, y'all. So while I'm telling this story, I'm gonna call the girl Rice and I'm gonna call him Beans. Okay. So this is how it all started. I'm gonna try to explain everything to y'all, like break it down to y'all. So he started with me posting something right and when i made my little post or whatever i tagged him in it i tagged beans in it so rice texts me and i'm gonna make sure i put the um the the screenshots and everything y'all the pictures of the messages every time i'm reading them i'm gonna make sure i put them on the uh, screen i don't know why i stood so motherfucking hard i was trying to say side but i said screen <laughs> but yeah i'm gonna put them up some uh well, over there so yeah okay so it started with me posting something and i tagged him in it or either i had um i had tagged him in a post that i seen so she was like so rice was like you and beans must still fuck with each other with the eyes or whatever so i text back and i was like yeah why she gonna say laughing my fucking ass off okay that's all I wanted to know because he been lying to me. So I'm like, yeah, LOL, he right here. So it was just like, at the time, me and him in my room, we chilling or whatever. He had just got to my house, y'all. Like, I'm telling y'all, he just got to my house. So I'm like, what's she talking about? Like, hmm, what? So I'm sitting there looking at him while he's sitting on the edge of the bed. And I'm like, should I say something or should I not? So I ain't say nothing at, at first, y'all. I didn't say nothing at first. Then she texts me again. Um, for the other, for the other message. Okay, yeah, right here. Rice texts me again. I had said after I said he was lying or whatever on the last one. Or yeah, he was out. He always lying. I said he always lying with the laughing emojis. She gonna uh, put some laughing emojis and say weak. Let me see. So I sent her a picture of him sitting on my bed because I'm like y'all not finna play with me. This this right here not what i'm finna do i don't even care if you want whoever this is baby go get her because why like be for real so she hearted it when i sent her the picture she hearted it so i sent her a thumbs up she said thank you i said you're welcome so i thought it was done right then and there i'm like okay she just wanted to know if i talked to him somebody do you still talk to him well, obviously he done told her already we don't talk or he don't talk to me no more. He done told her something about us not talking. So, what happened was, I had left it alone, y'all. I'm telling y'all, I left it alone. Didn't care nothing about it. And out of nowhere, I'm in school. He in school. And they on um, Facebook or whatever, playing, playing around, tagging each other and stuff. Then they started talking about this little this little game they supposed to be doing or whatever she was tagging him in and talking about some yo we're gonna have a team or whatever so i'm like okay that's fine i'm not you feel me i'm not mad about that so um right after they was after she texted me about that that's when i started thinking i'm like okay she texted me to my son he still talked to you so then I'm, I'm thinking now, like, he done told, he, he probably be telling everybody he done talk to me, but she done text me and said this, but I'm knowing this, y'all. I'm already knowing this. I'm just still talking to the boy because I want to. So, like, I done gave this boy chance after chance after chance, y'all. I'm telling y'all, chance after chance after chance. And his homeboys know that. My family know that. His family know that. Like, I could have been with him, but I didn't. So, 
after she texted me about that and we had our little conversation or whatever it was like he was at my house then the next day or the day after that he was talking about going down there to her city where they was having this little gang or community thing going on or whatever so he talked about some he going with his homeboys i'm like okay that's fine keep in mind my my so-called friend supposed to be my friend she go with them so i didn't even know that she went down there neither but i kind of figured that she was going because you know how females is or whatever but i kind of figured she was going because the people that she hang with and they whole group down there so i'm like okay if he going i know she going in the rest i'm going and ain't nobody gonna say nothing to me about it so they know i'm not gonna go but if, if they would have said something i probably would have went but i still wasn't gonna go so it's just like dang did nobody say nothing so i peeped in like ain't none of y'all real and i don't give a if y'all looking at this video and y'all know too much y'all y'all not real at all so my so-called friend was down there she didn't say nothing but he went down there to i asked her to come up here the next day or didn't know it was that day i asked her to come up here and help me do somebody hair or something and um while we was up here chilling or whatever so she was like you know he went down there to that little thing and i'm like no he didn't because he texted me right now he told me he at home and he sent me i, I said where you at yeah i'm sorry if i'm stuttering i just be talking so fast sometimes so i was like where you at and then he was like he at home so he sent me a picture of his feet propped up on on the tv stand in the living room or whatever so i'm like i'm like okay he at home maybe she's just saying it because you know how females do they be like if your friend telling you something about your man then that means she want him so i'm like i'm not saying that she want him it's just i'm saying like she don't got a man so i'm thinking maybe she's saying it just so i can go down there with her or trying to make an excuse for me to go with her so he came over here that same day so his foot was messed up y'all he wasn't even supposed to be down there the thing is he snuck down there so his foot was messed up i said what's wrong with your foot he took my some football y'all he was down there at the little thing and then skipped his foot up trying to run and then he didn't tell me till somebody told me he was down there then he owned up to it and was like yeah i was down there with him so i'm like okay fine bitch I ain't had no problem with that so i guess days later I don't got no messages right there. Okay, so yeah, days later. Um, let me see which ones I can pull up. Okay, right here he was in school. We was in school at the time. She don't go to school at all. So she was texting him while he was in school. He was this part. He was telling me while we in school. He telling me he in the sore room with his teacher or his coach or whatever. So I'm like, okay. So we kicking it, we, you feel me? We texting back and forth. We just chilling. Both of us in school texting back and forth. So I'm thinking everything fine, you feel me? So then I'm thinking, like, now it's my time to ask him questions. Like, he in store. Like, he ain't got nothing to do but think. Like, be for real. You finna come up off them lies, baby. So she was texting him, I guess. They was texting. Same time he texted me. Keep this in mind. Same time he texted me while he in store. He texted her too. So like, I don't get it. It's like, I don't get it. So he was texting her or been texting her, I guess. Remember, he left my house. He was at my house while this happened. The first time she texted me after that, I knew then to keep my guard up. It been up, y'all. But like I said, I give a chance because I believe in second chance. Like, but I gave him more than that. So and I'm not doing that no more. Just believe. But anyways he um he was texting her while he was in school and texting me at the same time because i was asking him who the girl was where she from how she know me obviously she know everything about me she just kept saying stuff trying to get up under my skin and it wasn't bothering me at all like not at all so while he in school or whatever these are not all the messages because they won't they're not gonna send me all of them so this is all i got from what they sent me so she texts him after i had did their little the day I did that tag, when I tagged him in that post, I guess it was the next day, and she was like, I knew you were still effing with her. That's what Rice said. So Beans was like, I don't. Chill the fuck out, okay? So, yeah, that's what he said, but he had missed though. He said, chill the fuck, okay? And um, so Rice was like, I come in. So Beans gonna say, man, I'm sick of mess. And only reason he said that and i know this boy only reason he said that is because like 
he didn't want me to find out about the girl at all. Like, when nobody gonna say nothing to me about her, she would have never text me. So, and the thing is, I never had a problem with with Rice. It's just how she came to me. Like, I never had a problem with her at all. It's just how you approached me about my so called man. You could have just came to me and been like, "Hey, your man trying to talk to me, or how long have you been talking to him? We've been talking for a minute now. You feel me?" So I wasn't too much worried about that neither. Um. So, yeah, he was basically saying he was sick of the mess because I had found out about him and her talking. Yeah. Okay. So, Rice is going to say, I don't give a fuck. I'm over you after today. And I'm like, when I'm reading these messages as they send them to me, I'm like, after today? What? How long have y'all been talking? Like, how long have this been going on that I don't know about? Like, that his homeboys know about? So, he going to say, man, chill. I deleted everything. DTM. Doing too much. Okay, so this I, I said that for the people that don't know what that means. So yeah, um, I'm just sitting here at this moment. I'm just like, once I got to that part, I'm like, now you telling her you deleted stuff. Like, what you delete stuff for? If we go together, why is you deleting stuff? Like, yeah, and I'm gonna tell y'all some more after this, like after I finish this story. So Rice was like, B F U, I'm finna be on the way up there. You got me F up. Y'all, I kid y'all not. I kid y'all not. The same time she said she was on her way up there, me and her was still arguing at this time, but I don't have the messages with me and her fussing still. Like, I got a whole new Facebook and everything because I didn't want all them people on my thing. Like, it was just that bad. Like, I didn't, I, I didn't want nobody on my shit. You feel me? So, like, I just didn't want all that negativity on me, putting a bad look on me. They trying to embarrass me and show out because, like, this boy cheating and doing other shit. Like, you as a whole female, come to me as a female. Don't do that weird shit. I hate weird females. Like, that shit is so not cute. So, yeah. And I, was, I wasn't I was embarrassed at all. They felt like they was embarrassing me, but I never was embarrassed. So, make sure y'all get that, too. Um, so he gonna say what she said yeah be ready but like I said kids y'all not she talk about something she on the way up there like I said only reason she said she was on the way was because I said that I was on the way to his house whole time I'm not even in school bitch I'm waiting on y'all to get here okay I'm waiting on y'all to get here because what what I want to know what's going on please tell me what's up so he in school I'm telling him I right, bet I don't know if I was in school or if I was already out of school I think I checked out or if I I don't know if I, I didn't go to school because it i'm gonna show y'all a picture too of me and my sister standing at the road so she said she was on the way so i said i'm on the way too i said beat me there or meet me there so what happened was i was already there he was in school and i was waiting on him to get out of school i'm testing him i'm like okay babe i'm gonna meet you at your house i want you to pull up like what's up what y'all what y'all got going on you feel me let me know something that i don't know so he um he ended up pulling up. I sat at the end of his road. Actually, I went to his house. I pulled down there to his house. And after that, I ended up driving back to the end of the road by the um stop sign. So I'm waiting on them. I'm waiting on everybody to pull up. Everybody saying they pulling up. Where are y'all? Nowhere to be found. So we still we sat out there for I don't know how long, y'all. So it was so hot. Like, I don't know. So we still sitting there at the stop sign waiting on everybody to pull up she said she was on the way she never did come so i'm like these bitches lying like hoes just be talking like you think you think i don't even think this hoe got a car and i really thought this hoe was gonna pull up on me bitch you don't even have a car what so i'm, I'm sitting there at the time thinking like how she finna pull up and she ain't got no car because last time i checked she was driving somebody else's car that ain't got nothing to do with me at all y'all but i'm saying though like at the time when she said it my so-called friend was doing one uh rice friend hair and rice friend let her use the car to drive back to where they stay at till she got done getting her hair done so rice came back to pick her up well her sister somebody was driving her car so rice friend was like girl i give you my mace she was texting me to my girl i give you my mace so you can mace them and da, 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 da. i'm like bitch i'm gonna mace you too if i mace everybody you can mace too i don't give a fuck if i got it from you you feel me so yeah and yeah so other than that it was just like wow so like i said everybody was saying they was coming they never did come he ended up coming but he was trying to talk stuff out i'm like no i don't want to hear none of that y'all need to tell me what i need to know like i'm not gonna sit here and be dumb and and you feel me be a fool for you or a take up for you no none of that too off of it no bs fuck that shit so to keep it going 
he ended up okay after that what had happened we sitting there waiting on them that never did come yeah she kept saying girl i'm gonna do this girl i'm gonna do that when i see you we come and trust and believe i will be there you never did come not at all never seen you down there and then the time y'all was down there in that city when i came down there to that city i never i didn't see y'all not at all hmm. but i ain't worried about none of that okay so then let me see where else where else was it? um what i want to read for that Mm. I'm going to go to this part when she said, I guess they were still texting or whatever. And he going to say, she know she texted me. And she texted me. I guess she added me on Snap just to say what she wanted to say. So she was like, she sent the little eyes, the eyes emoji. And she sent the, oh. Uh, she said, um, no, I actually, I had her on Snap, and I accidentally screenshotted her, her thing, like, I screenshotted her thing, because it said she added me, so I sent it to somebody, and I was like, who is this? So they was like, that's that girl that's arguing with you over, over, uh, beans or whatever, so I'm like, what? Then I'm like, I'm, I'm thinking then, like, I'm like, now she finna have something to say, thinking that I done screenshotted her stuff, trying to be funny or something, so I knew it was gonna get some shit started, boom, I'm ready for it, it is what it is. So she sent the little eyes, whatever. I sent the question mark. She going to say, um, so Rice was like, it said you screenshotted my profile. I said, I said, girl, I screenshot your shit to show my, uh, to show my sister what, what I was talking about when me and my man got into an argument about you. And then I was like, nothing weird, uh, going on. And it said you added me or something. So at that time I knew, I knew. Okay, yeah, before I had texted her and said I was trying to show my sister who you was, I didn't know who it was before I sent it to her. Then when they told me, that's when I was like, yeah, I'm trying to tell them what had happened then since that you that had, since that was you that added me, basically. So then uh, Rice going to say you're a man with some laughing emojis. And no, you added me. I never added you because I wasn't, I wasn't stunning you, to be honest, because I know what's going on. That's why I wasn't stunning shit. So, if you know what's going on, why you didn't just tell me, for one, like, it's giving uh, not mature, you're not at all. It's giving, what is it giving? I don't know, it's not women, like, to, to do nothing like that at all, but still, like, if you know about me, I hate when a female know about you and they steady mess with your man, like, be for real, if that was your man and you was in my position, you would want to fight. I promise to God, you would want to fight. So, like, why would you do it to somebody else? And I can understand if you do fight or you are a fighter, of course you're going to do whatever and fight whoever. But, no, baby, I don't do all that fighting. Not over no man anyways. So, I was like, what's going on? Because somehow, uh, somehow, what, what to say? Somehow ain't telling me nothing, baby. Let me know some because uh, you want them. And, yeah, my man, but I know. I know he belonged to everybody. Then I said some, I said something else or something like that. We would just go ugly, y'all. I'm talking about we would just arguing bad, but to not meet up, to not see each other at all, that's what made me mad. I don't even care about the argument. I was really just typing just to type because I was high as fuck. I ain't even gonna lie. I was sitting in the car with my homegirl and my uh my homeboy. We was in the car uh whatever. And yo, okay, y'all. So yeah, I'm back. My camera not focused. still not okay there you go okay but anyways my man had called me too y'all but i was in the car i was in the car with my home girl and my homeboy like i said and we was you know gassing up or whatever and that's how it really started she texted me out of nowhere and i'm thinking i'm gonna go with them and have a good time but she texted me out of nowhere right so i'm like who is this texting me then they like who is that? Then she started texting me about him, and I'm like, okay, this her again. So I'm sitting there telling him, I'm like, take me home, take me home, take me home right now. I'm telling him, take me home. I'm like, get me back to where I came from now, so I get to my car. Whole time, once again, I'm not pulling up to nobody's house, nobody's crib, no none of that. Whatever it is, if you ain't got no car to meet me, know where I'm not going because consequences come with them. But anyways, 
<laughs> yeah she kept on texting me to my she'll beat me up because i guess somebody told her that me and my friend said that we was gonna jump her and and the only person that i know said that was beans because he was the only one that was at my my granny house with me we didn't we never said we was gonna jump her at all i said if she want to fight we can fight one-on-one but if they think they're gonna jump us then we're gonna we're gonna jump them back like not saying it's gonna be a jump and jump like they jump us then boom we jump them back it's just gonna be like if y'all think y'all gonna jump me i'm bringing my crew with me too and we just gonna be jumping each other you feel me so i guess he went back and told her i know he went back and told her because he's the only person that we said something like jumping somebody around and he fake as fuck for that if you watching this video beans you fake bitch and i don't fuck with you but anyways yeah um with that being said what if what i give with that phone but you had to get the phone all right let me go back to the um messages okay okay so this is back this is back when um she texted me i'll snap again y'all so rice was like me and beans been going together excuse me she said, I asked him about you. He told me not to be stun you because you're delusional. Let me start right there. Everybody know. Everybody know. Everybody know. If you know Diamond, you know Diamond not delusional. Ain't nobody ever just said, oh, you delusional. All the people gonna say that is my friends. If I'm around them and we talking, and that's with any group of girls and their friends, and you talk about your man all the time, and they just like, you delusional, you delusional this, you delusional that. Anybody else? can't call me delusional ain't no proof of me being delusional at all whatsoever i don't give a fuck how you put it how you try to solve the damn puzzle i'm not delusional and i don't give a fuck how you put it so i never been known for being delusional other than people putting a bad image out there on me like that so other than that no baby i ain't never been delusional i i can't i can't even just uh -uh. Mm -mm. so yeah and it's just funny to me because all the lies that they was telling is just crazy like i don't understand y'all too old please. for one you're grown and he how old 17 18 yeah 17 because he just turned 18 let's not play and you like 19 20 or why so she was like he swear he only came to your house the other day because you was finna do his hair ha 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 Keep in mind, y'all, I was supposed to do his hair, but when she texted me, I cut it in. I was like, this boy really think I'm going to do his hair. You know what? I'm not even going to do his hair because who do you think you are texting other females in my house, in my bed? You feel me telling them things like, I'm delusional, I'm not crazy, I'm not going to do nothing. Basically thinking, you making them feel like I'm scared. Like, you just got them feeling like, oh, he taking up for her. No. That's what I don't want, baby. I can stand on my own by myself, best believe. And if I need any help, I got siblings for a reason. Hello. So, she was like, he will be, yeah, she was like, he will be down here today. I'll let you see. And I want him, question mark, got him. What is you saying? So, I guess she was saying... He would be down here today. I don't know. I guess she was saying he was supposed to go to her house or whatever, and she was going to show me that he down there, but baby, she never did send me a picture nor a video of them cuddled up or nothing, not even them doing nothing at all, baby. She never did send proof of nothing. So at this point, I'm just like, okay, I want to see it. I'm going to wait. Days go by. Never got a video, never got a picture, never got proof of him being down there. So I'm like, okay, maybe I can believe him. He said he didn't do nothing with her, but he did say that he was down there like twice because I caught him down there twice without him telling me. So yeah, he got caught actually. Then he ended up owning up to it because the stuff that I was telling him, I'm like, yeah, I'm not done. So it was just like, it was just like, y'all, y'all really try to play me. Like, why is y'all trying to play me type shit? Like, don't do that. There's something that you just don't do. So then she texts me again after we was okay. This is some more messages, but like I didn't it don't have the other part of what I said. It just got it like what I said about you too, about something. Something yeah. Like that. So she said, Girl, you definitely delusional. I was just at 
him house with him. So when was this? I was just there with his siblings and whatever. You delusional. She didn't say his brother name, so I'm thinking, okay, she don't know. She don't know them for real. She just know the sister name because the sister friendly as fuck. I ain't even gonna hold you. The sister friendly as fuck, baby. She'll talk to anybody that he talks to. Get close to anybody that he talks to. You feel me? If he get a girlfriend today, she gonna get close with his girlfriend. Me, I was never the type of that she got close to. What? I don't care. Never did care. And I'm not being rude if you watching this video, but like, I, I, I it's just, it's just weird. You feel me? And I don't too much care for being, uh, to be close to nobody that I talk to siblings, I don't too much care for it. Like, we cool, we cool, we kicking it. Ain't no problem between us, even if we don't speak. But her, and then she, you know, so I really don't care at all. So I was like, um, she was like, damn, what happened, in-law? Then that's what she had me fucked up at, talking about in-law. Bitch, don't call me your in-law at all, because we ain't no type of motherfucking in-law at all. Like, where you get in-law from? I don't give a fuck if he's your boyfriend and my boy. We ain't no fucking in-laws, baby. I'm not your baby stepmom and I'm not the motherfucking, I'm not the damn uncle, the daddy, the papa, none of that. Whatever you got going on, I'm not, I don't got nothing to do with it. So I was like, shit, girl. I'm like, shit, I don't know, girl. He needs to be real with us and let it, let it be known so we can go viral. And then I was like, him with a question mark. Like, you talk about him? So she going to say, need to... I told you we can be a family. For one, let me stop you right there. Baby, I don't want to be a family with you at all. Never, ever. Y'all ghetto for no reason. Not cute at all. Like, I'm not saying you're not cute. You, you all right, Bryce. But you're not ugly, but you're not cute neither. It's just, it just don't give, like, the attitude. You can't be cute with a bad attitude like that they, they don't go together so she was like he keeps talking about making a damn baby you can be the stepmama lady who said i wanted to be a stepmama bitch if i wanted some kids i have my own best believe i would have my own kids if i wanted to be a mother no i don't want to be nobody's stepmama not at all so at that point i'm just like what she get Talking about he want to have a baby, and before he was telling her that, I'm like, I'm like, he telling me the same thing. Talking about he want me to be his baby mama, yada yada yada, and I'm like, okay, so you telling her you want her to have your kids, but then you telling me the same thing the whole time she pregnant, got a baby on the way. Once, once she announced that she was pregnant or whatever, I'm like, oh, so this his baby. He been messing with her, so this his baby. Like, I'm, I'm sitting here confused. I don't know what. I ain't even gonna hold you. So. Everybody asking me, is that his baby? Is that his baby? I'm like, I don't know. Stop asking me, y'all. Now y'all pissing me off because I feel like I've been played with for six fucking years. Be for real now. So then, I guess another little altercation had happened, and it was something about them saying she don't know who her baby daddy is or whatever. And she was like, I don't know. She was saying something about him talk about some she know who her baby daddy is and i'm like in my head mm. she kept asking me to be the step mama no baby i'm not your in-law i'm not your step nothing okay i'm not so it goes to my messages i guess they was testing again or whatever and this when all that stuff had happened again when they was trying to embarrass me and it didn't work so i guess he was begging for her back and she didn't want him back or whatever so she was like what do you want you need to leave me the f alone for real he said you and this this him texting i know this him texting it sounds like him texting i know him i've been with him for the longest y'all i'm telling y'all i know how I, how how he takes like it's, it's no way around it. Like, I know him. So, it's just like, this is the same way he would text me if he was begging for me back or trying to get me to communicate with him when I'm mad or something. So, he's talking about some you. She going to say, apparently, you want me and Diamond. She can have you. Baby, let me tell you something. If I ever find out my man talking to somebody else, you can have him, baby. Don't tell me I can have him because I already done had him. It's your turn. You feel me? Don't tell me I can have what I already got. Cause I did at this point I don't want it no more. So he gonna say, B's gonna say, 
y'all been fussing for the longest like not at this point he had me irritated because it's like you talking about y'all been fussing for the longest but we, i never was fussing with her i was just talking back through the phone with her because you told me you was gonna meet me and we never did meet up so at this point i don't give a fuck at all so i didn't care and he was like we've been fussing for the longest whatever so i'm like you talking about we've been fussing for the longest but you steady agging it on talk about you want her and you want me you telling me you want me in my phone then you tell her you want her and her phone is not adding up so then she gonna say weird ads you weird hell yeah we've been fussing with a question mark but have her like she she was thinking too like we've been fussing with a question mark like we've been fussing we ain't been fussing baby not at all and i'm glad you know that so she gonna say but you can have her don't tell him he can have me don't tell him he can have me i ain't even gonna put my implement on that part and then he gonna say man you know i want you that's what he had me fucked up at how you want me and gonna be with me for six six years and then gonna tell another female you want her be so for real now and this ain't even the only female that he was texting y'all like his other messages and and stuff of him i'll make a part three if y'all want me to if y'all want me to do a part three make sure y'all comment down below and let me know but i'm finna end this video right here with this female that he cheated with and yeah um that's the end of my little video of beans and rice and i'm finna close this out because it's getting late or whatever but y'all let me know if y'all want part three of um how i found out i was getting cheated on and i'm gonna give y'all them videos because i know this video gonna be a little long uh and yeah i'm gonna take my tail up in here and my loves before y'all exit this video make sure y'all like comment and subscribe and turn on y'all post notifications if you don't have them on period